taking Kaylee for a trail ride for her birthday, and I am excited. Okay, things are going badly. This is going bad. <laughs> Kaylee, for your early birthday, we're going on a trail ride. No, we're not. We are, and I told your dad. No, we're not. We are. <laughs> no, we're not. Oh my god. That's gosh. why Molly was acting strange when I was. Molly's coming you. with us. We're going to the trail place. No, we're not. You're pranking me. I'm not even pranking you. No, I literally Please. just got changed because we freaking just got home. We just got home. Okay, you're she's gonna cry. She's like, oh, I do not want to go. So, oh my gosh, what the heck is wrong with you? So, yeah, now that's happening. Like, now we're behind the game. I still have to get money from the bank machine. And my jacket. And riding boots, like, holy heck, we're not gonna make it. Ah! So we wanted to surprise her. I told her to bring her riding stuff. She didn't. All right, we are running late, you guys, so late. I jumped in the car as fast as I could, flew to Kaylee's place, we're gonna be late. I messaged the lady, we're gonna be late, but we're gonna make it, we're absolutely gonna make it. Okay, so we're on our way, we finally got back. I was speeding, first time in my life I've ever been speeding. I was really speeding too, like, and I don't condone speeding, I think speeding is bad. Sam tells me all the time that if I should be going the speed of traffic, I should not be, I, like, I should not be going the speed limit. I should always be going at least 10 over the speed limit. I don't do that though. But I do have a question for you guys. So I am wearing my tall boots, and I, I haven't worn them for a long time, so the last time I wore them, and this time, they feel really tight. They is it normal? Big. They look too big for me? Yeah. They're not done up. Yeah. I'm about to do them up, but my feet hurt in them now. Like, what? what is with that? Feet got wider. My feet did not get wider. Do they shrink up is my question. How do many they... times have you worn them? You I've worn them about six up. times. Well, you need to break them in more. Oh, well, they hurt. I hate that. That is the only bad part. Literally, my foot is hurting in my boot. Okay. No, it's not. No, it's not. That's the wrong color. All right, you guys. Do you think this horse is too small for me? No. Just, I like that saddle. I'd like no, to try a new saddle. Like, I think that's her horse, probably. So this oh, horse. Yeah, that's her saddle. saddle. So my new horse, I think, is 15 hands high. I think this one is 15 hands high. I'm getting one. A Paso Fino. I'm coming to ride. Yeah. Did you? She's very solid. All right. So her name is La Roca. La Roca. La Roca. So I'm riding La Roca in a different saddle. Okay, so today I'm riding La Roca and she's 14.3 and she's a lot wider than the average Pasifino. Um, so I have um, Camilla here. I have Camilla here who owns this barn. She's amazing. So I always find you such an amazing, <laughs> like I love being here because oh, it's cute. such a positive atmosphere. Um, I wanted to ask you about the weight for the Pasifino. Um, well, you know, Pasifinos, some will say they can carry more weight for their size. Some will say a horse is a horse. So uh, I always say you kind of have to look at the individual. Gabby, don't. <laughs> that was kind of wild. <laughs> that was kind of wild. Um, so between 20 and 30%, depending on who you talk to, and, and different people are going to have different ideas of what that number should be and that's that's a ratio of uh, riders weight to horses weight right so obviously the bigger the horse uh, of any the, breed yeah the more for they sure. can carry that being said uh, a shorter backed horse can carry more weight because picture the strength of a right you know, if you put a weight on a long plank versus a short plank wow. same kind of concept and the other thing that the pasifino has that's different with the gait means that they don't trot which means there's not the suspension land suspension land less concussion on the joints oh. I so love that you. makes the rider more comfortable, but it also makes it easier for the horse to transport weight because they're shuffling. They're basically okay. Walking. Yeah, I wondered about that. I was laying Rather in bed than... this morning wondering about that. Yeah. So I, you, so she, Camilla knows the horse that I'm going to try. Um, yeah. Do you feel that I would be too heavy for her? Or do you think I would be okay? So what I would say is you look at her weight. So you can take a weight tape. You wanna, you wanna land somewhere in the probably you know, maximum 25% kind of range right. of her weight. Mm -hmm. And then you also want to look at considerations of age, soundness, angle for fetlocks. The more dro dropped their fetlocks, you know, the less weight they can hold. So I see some very, uh, you see Cozy's not only a light horse, but a very light boned horse. Okay. Not a lot of substance in her, not a lot of weight. Okay. So I, I never put a big rider on yeah. her. Yeah, okay. Um, even though she would probably do it, she shouldn't. Right, yeah. <laughs> 
Uh, so that's a lot. Her. She's got really nice angle. She's not really dropped in the past. Terms. Okay. She's got a huge amount of chest, so she's not a little plank of a horse. Yeah. She's a good solid bone. Okay. Horse. Um, and probably she probably weighs in around the I'm gonna say she's probably around the thousand pound mark like okay. my gelding. Okay. Which means she should be carrying. Uh, you know, maximum 240 to 50 pounds. Perfect. And not heavy work at that. So basically, uh, this horse is perfect for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I like this that's saddle. That's kind of the that's kind of the ratio we use. Some would say 20 percent. Some are restricted with 20 percent. Yeah. Some uh, say they can take up to 30 percent. But I say you've always got to look at the individual. Horse. Yeah. If you've got okay. a horse who's got a history of soundness issues, yep. tendon, you know, weaknesses or injuries. Obviously, they need less. Okay. Less load. Thank you a, so much. Okay, so we are ready to go. I'm up on uh, La Roca. I'm on La Roca, and I feel really comfortable on her. So normally, I ride the horse that that Molly's riding. Oh, Molly's here. Say hi, Molly. Normally, I ride her, and I feel really comfortable on her. I'm well below the limit that this horse can carry. Um. She gave me so many things to think about, so many things to look at, so many, so much information, like so much good information. But anyway, we're here. We're gonna get ready, go on our ride. I'm excited to ride another horse. That's, she got it for Christmas. Did she? Mm -hmm. Maybe you should give me a Christmas. Present. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so there's my girl. So that girl is definitely a lot smaller than this girl. No, that one's smaller than this one. No, this one's bigger. No. You're, no, yes. They're about the same size. Are they? That one's for sure really small. I she but was this bigger. saddle, like I thought I wanted the I other saddle. This one, I think I need to steal it. You like that one? Yeah, like like really comfy. comfy. Yeah. yeah, I like. I love the long stirrups and. Okay, I thought this one was um the one I rode last time. That's the one I rode. Yeah. So I was like, oh yeah, this is definitely the one I rode last time. So then we got all mixed up and confused. I love them. Okay, so Kaylee's riding. Who's Kaylee riding again? Oh, trainer. Trainer. So every time we come here with Kaylee, she's always got the same horse. Okay, I feel like I need to take off this. I feel like I need to take off my sweater too. Okay. But it's gonna. We're gonna be in the woods. Yeah, maybe I'll be cold. Oh, stop it! That's best if someone who's not afraid to push them. Push and collect them a little bit. Does anything gate at a trot? And when he canters, just don't let him put his head down. <laughs> Light. He's not gonna like. He'll never run away. He'll never drag the reins out of your hands. But if he starts going like this, the next thing he's gonna do is just hump his shoulders because little kids just fly off the front when he does that. Right. Oh, <laughs> Kaylee, just like, save me. Kaylee, yeah, like he he just literally lazily goes like that and shakes them off the front and then eats grass. Oh, okay. Katie, it's like K Katie. So Kaylee, Kaylee, it's like Spitty. He scare horses. Down, so then, none of these horses kick, so we're good. Oh, perfect. But trainer apparently doesn't like one of them. Oh, oh probably okay. mine. <laughs> no, because he wouldn't go. I really like this saddle. I do not know what it is, but I love it. It's Can you comfy. Stop pinning your ears, please. Yeah, yeah Molly does not like a rude pony. No. I like this one. The Rocco. I got Azzy Lemieux and now I start matching stuff. Oh stuff no. Yeah. You turned into a matchy match girl? I did. <gasps> Molly. We never thought Molly would be a matchy match girl. I have it on video. You were like, oh my god. I no, match, Fiona's it like, needs to stop. No, Fiona's like, oh my god, Molly, you're matching. And you're like, I hate it. I know and I hate it. Yeah, I don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, so she must not like my horse. <laughs> Don't. Don't fight me. Do it. Excuse me. <laughs> what are you doing? I find that. No, she's got a bellyache. Okay, so this is a 15 hand horse that weighs. He can actually probably carry a little less weight than that one because uh, you might notice when he goes, he has a really flexy pastern. So I would not put, say, more than. 210, 220 on this guy just because of that. Okay. So even though he's taller, maybe weighs as much or even more than her. Can you stop? Um, what I was talking about, that confirmation. Yeah. All right, we are up and at it. I got Molly's always behind me. Kaylee in the back. I'm excited to ride this new horse. I love her. Like, I love the feeling of her. She's such a big horse. And she's only a thousand pounds, but she feels amazing. Looks like, and then our leader in front. So I'm second in command here today. And I'm ready to rock it. Yes. Are you ready?
I can't talk, by the way, guys, because um, I'm being bounced and it's like I'm bouncing. <laughs> Queen. I say that all the time. I want a horse that wants to go out there and go. I hate riding a horse that doesn't want to go. Yeah, yeah, and it's not that I'm afraid to kick or I don't want to kick. It, I don't, yeah, like I don't want, I feel the energy of the horse and I don't want to like make somebody do something they don't want to do. Okay, I'm putting my camera away because we are jumping. <laughs> Every time I ride these horses and I show it in my videos, I people say, oh my God, Laura, what is wrong with you? Why are you so different when you ride these horses? Oh, really? Yeah, I'm so different. I'm a Paso person. Like this horse is a hundred percent different than the other one, and I love this one better. I hear so much giggling. <laughs> Is that you barking back there? <laughs> wow. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Amazing. Who's got the best horse here? I me. me. I do. <laughs> me. We all say me. 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 Because I'm the guest. Nobody ever actually thinks of me. Molly, you have to move. We used to all be up in your neck of the woods. We all moved. You got to move and be. <laughs> we did. She will. She jumps beautifully. Okay. But she will try to sneak out. Okay. So don't be afraid to boot her and open that ring. All right. All right so we're going to draw it. We're going to do a little bit of jumping. Girls have so much big smiling faces. Three in a row there. There's this little what we call the Olympic jump because it used to have Olympic hula hoops, but they've all fallen apart. There's a tire there. There's tiny little cross rails behind those trees, and then there's two far ones over there. If you want, I can lead you. Do you want me to lead you around? Will my horse just stand here with me? Yeah. Okay. If she tries to, I'll just stop her. I want to come jump with you. If I knew how to jump, I would do. I would go do it. They're going. They're leaving me. They're going jumping. <laughs> that's Gabby's horse, or that's Kaylee's horse. Okay, you guys. <laughs> I hear laughing. I don't know what's happening. The deer's come and knock down the jump, she says. This is incredible. Oh, she's beautiful. Oh, gorgeous. <laughs> you, and you guys could all do this too. This is a Fina Vista farm, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I should have just did it. You guys, I can't, I can't tell you like this horse is even 150% better than the other horse that I've been riding. There you go. Good girl. That was fun. Yeah, they'll always like, uh, is this like a kid that's not going to make me do anything? Or is this a kid that's going to make me do stuff? He always checks. <laughs> he can absolutely top level or absolutely the laziest one in the world. <laughs> he's, he's gone to nationals and won a youth 
National Obstacle Championship really? in Kentucky mm. and can do any obstacle in the world. But if you just say, okay, we do it for me, he'll go. Oh. <laughs> you have to like, wake up, trainer. Let's get this done. Because yeah. he's very chill for a passing. All right, we should go just one more time. You want one more? Yeah. One more. One more. All right. Molly's not afraid. <laughs> She's not afraid to say, let's do it again. Yeah. your head down, please. Yes, thank you. All oh, round. All oh, right. <laughs> like I love this you guys like I I just wish you could all come and experience this with us They're gonna do one more time because oh my horse wants to go too. I just don't know how to jump and I don't want to do the wrong thing for the horse. But man, if I could, I would. I just went too wide on that. I was trying oh, to remember no. where it is. Come on, Cozy! Yeah. We're in a county forest and it is a forest. Holy heck. Look at that. Oh, don't go up that horse's bum. Uh oh. Uh -huh. Going. Isn't this beautiful? Like, this is just beautiful. I mean, with this saddle, I don't even feel like I'm sitting hard on this. <laughs> talking Laura talk now? Are you talking Laura talk? This has been amazing. I keep telling all my viewers, the older women, I have a lot of older women that say, Laura, I'd love to ride again, but I'm older. I have this injury and I keep telling them, you need to get on a gated horse. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, knee problems, back problems. Yeah, I know. I, 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 the other big thing that's a shock to me is that when I was younger, I never wanted a horse. I just, I never realized they had personalities. But yeah, that, that was a big shock too. Oh. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh. You guys got to do it again so I can catch it. Hold back. So this is what the girls do the whole ride. Okay, hold back, hold back, hold back. Uh oh, you better hurry. And then they canter. <laughs> oh, there's water. That's water. <laughs> there's a puddle, but when you're on horseback, it's water. Woo! <laughs> oh gosh! Good girl! Woo! <laughs> so what is this 
gate. Canter though. These guys are probably gating. They might be cantering back. Right. So we're just gating. And it's fast. But you can just sit there. Yeah. You guys are going on a gallop. Come on. Okay, I might want to lose my shirt. Bye. Bye. Are you okay, Kaylee? Yeah. <laughs> that did not sound okay. So I did this, you guys. I galloped on this horse. Like for a long period of time. Uh oh, she's he's, she's getting mad. You're okay. We're almost home. You're okay. Oh oh. I had no stirrups during the whole thing. It's actually a lot easier. <laughs> Easy, pretty girl. Good girl. <laughs> I was just like, holy crap, we're actually going. I'm like, oh my god, we're going faster? <laughs> that was fun. You can feel them stretch out and cover the ground. <laughs> Me with my no stirrups like this the whole time. <laughs> oh, that was the best. I know. I, <laughs> I know. I was like, all right. I know! But then I also feel like at any minute she ducks her head and I go Poof! Yeah. <laughs> That's why I didn't touch her. I learned when you squeeze her, she puts her... Oh, where is my mom going? Again. We gotta come again. Fun! I thought we were just going the same speed, then you went, and I was like, oh. I know, I was like, do you guys wanna go faster? And I didn't hear anything, so I'm like, okay. <laughs> 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 yeah, because your horse is not that fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I need the knee brace. Yeah. Every time I always think like I wish I had brought treats. Look, she's looking for treats. I like this horse. If sh your knee hurts? We did a lot. Did you did you bang into a tree? No. We did a lot, you guys. I cantered for across fields and up hills like I cantered. Oh, I didn't get to take off my stirrups, but literally never done more on a horse in my life. Happily like like, I feel I've never galloped before. Gabby's That's never actually galloped before. They galloped. I heard you guys screaming. Like, was it, was it, what, did it feel really fun? Yeah, that was as we were walking. I love this farm. I love this place. I love the lady that owns it. I like, I, I want to make this a part of her life more. 
So it costs $40 plus GST. So it comes to about $45 to uh, ride on a trail. The trails are like an hour like and a half to two hours. You like the stallion? Yeah. He's that one. Yeah, he's cute. <laughs> so, so yeah. So, yeah. So, so this is what I'm getting. So she's between. The, so she's almost this size. She's she's pretty much the size the horse that I'm Finn's getting. Bigger. Yeah, Finn does seem bigger. Finn is bigger. Well, I don't know. This is. I don't know. Maybe people don't know their sizes. Finn, Finn is bigger. But so this this horse. This horse is the same size that. Pretty I much love, the same size that I'm getting. Cozy? That's, that's cozy. Trainer. Oh, that's trainer. I always get them. He's cute. Like he would be too small for me. I loved my horse. That was the most fun ride I've ever had in my life. Was it the most fun trail ride you've ever had in your life? Hip when you're galloping, lose your stirrups. Yeah. Where's Kaylee? Is she off crying somewhere? What'd you think, Kaylee? Were you expecting it to be that fun? Yeah. It was literally so much fun, you guys. Like, I can't even tell you. I don't know what kind of saddle I want to get now. That one was really nice. Oh. Oh, no, your Lululemons. Can I rinse you? Let's go find the apple so I can give my horse an apple. These horses love water. They love to be washed down. Mom, how many do you want for her? Just give me two. Oh. Here. Oh. Hey, wait. Give me this one. You know? Oh, that's a big apple. They're nice. Like like oh, she's got nice apples. I got you the biggest apple. Take a bite. Good girl. I got three. You're only allowed to give them one, she said. She just wanted them to get a belly ache, maybe. This horse deserves this. Wow, that was so much fun. You guys, I can't even explain. Like, this is going to be my life soon. Like, I never want to stop riding. Like, this time I went up, down, up trails, or this time I went down, this time I went down hills, like, no problem. Didn't even bother me. Didn't even phase me. Good girl. Such a good, she, she just had, like, a little spot bath. Yeah. Feels good. I'd give you another apple if I could. But you're not my horse and I don't want to ruin you. Did you have fun, Molly? Yes. So was it the best oh, ride that you've yeah. had? Is it the best ride out of everything you've ever had? I do love jumping, but that was lots of fun too. You did jumping. Yeah, I know. I know. But I the galloping, yeah, like the, the hills. I used fun. to be nervous of going down hills. That was incredible. And there's some steep hills. Yeah. Bye, LaRocca. I hope I ride you next time. By the time I come back here, I'll have my own Pasofino probably. Yes. <laughs> See you later. I love her. She's amazing. So the only thing I didn't do on the trail was gallop and I wanted a video and actually I was nervous to gallop. Like, I mean, I feel like I probably could have done it, but I didn't want to gallop. I, I, I kind of feel sad that I didn't, but next year, we're going to go back again this year, but I don't think, I think I need like a year of riding my Pasofino. I'm, like, I want a Pasofino more than ever before. This is the second Pasofino I've ever ridden, and I found her to be the Cadillac of Pasofinos. This Pasofino was a hundred times better than the Pasofino that I loved before. Like, a hundred times better. You got the same one, you got the same one that you always ride. They galloped. Kaylee, how did you find the galloping? Were you scared? She's eating birthday brownies, you guys. Gabby said that Gabby said that it was really fun until she realized like she was actually galloping. Like that's the first time she ever galloped, like really gallop. And she said, when you feel them extend their gait, um, it was amazing until you realize that you're galloping. And then if you like do one bad thing, you could fly over. Like you look down. No. No, I forget what you said. They'll buck you off. Yeah, they could buck you off. Like, but yeah, they're, they're really nice horses. And the saddle that I rode today, was a million times I thought, nicer than I the one that I rode in before. Go the same speed, but then on the way home she went, and I was like, oh. So I we were I was in the lead at the end. They I my horse wanted to go home. You guys saw that, and then all of a sudden she's like, I'm cantering home, and all of a sudden I just started cantering up this hill. Like I cantered down, and then I cantered up this hill. And I was like, oh, what? Are we and the girls were like, oh, what is happening? Did you guys canter after me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
Molly was like, they were making every experience that they, they were taking every opportunity that they could to do other things. And Molly is like not shy. So she's like, can we go jump those jumps? Can we go through some water? Can we do a different trail? It was a different trail this time, wasn't it? It's On six o'clock. So we were riding for almost two hours. So um, it was a different, yeah, it was a different, we did a lot of different stuff. And we, she took us to two different spots that we could canter, but we cantered a bunch of times. Did we canter a bunch of times? Yeah. And then we did like the faster Paso gate is, what is it called? Corsa or something? I forgot, I need to get up onto that stuff. No, Corso, Corso or something? Corso? I think what? it's a fat it's their faster gait before a canter so anyways it was incredible I was I rode my my heart out you guys she was in front of me and we were like cantering up hills and I just was I mean a long long stretch and I just was it was amazing like I'm so sad I'm sitting in a car right now like I just want to get on on those horses again and go riding again like you I can't even explain how much this has changed my life these horses have changed my life anyway that is it for this video because we're gonna get ready we're going home and we're gonna start another video and it's a fun one i'm excited first i have to edit and then we're gonna do it um so that we can end the summer with a bang the extra yeah. fun um a 24 hour video for you guys i hope you guys i hope you guys like this video and i hope you guys understood what she was talking about about the sizes and about the size of the rider versus the horse like she's a wealth of information this lady she's been into paso finos for the longest time years and years and years she runs a really amazing business she teaches she's a teacher she has a thriving business she does camps you should check out her facebook page to see the camps that she does with all those little kids all these beginner kids go on those horses and they're jump like they they do it all these like little seven-year-old kids have never ridden before by the end of a week's Except camp the they're doing it all uh, it's Fina Vista farm and uh, look it up on Facebook you'll be shocked at their camp she does that and then she also does like the trail rides like we go there and we do trail she does a lot of trail rides it's the only trail ride that I've ever known or in this area that actually allows you to do stuff she said that she quite enjoys it when she gets riders that can ride like the girls can ride because it's the only time she really ever actually gets to go and do stuff because most trail people they've never ridden before so she has to just kind of do a walk with them but we jumped we did like it was amazing you guys uh thanks for watching we'll see you guys in the next video don't you know that you're beautiful